weird story. I also went out to lunch with my daughter. Hey, Phyrexian Alliterator, thanks for the gifted subscriptions. I got your name right for the first time in history, I think. Um, I went out to lunch with my daughter, and, uh, you know, we were about to leave, and uh, a, an old woman came in. She was probably in her 70s, if not her early 80s. And she sat down, she was by herself, and then she looked over to me and she was like, do you like it here? And I was like, here, like the neighborhood or here, the restaurant? And she was like, here, the neighborhood. And I said, yeah, I like it here. It's nice. And then she literally, like the second thing she said to me after we'd known each other for 30 seconds, she said, who the fuck can afford to live here anymore? And I said, I don't know. It is expensive, but you know, everywhere in the city is expensive. And then she was like, the, the server brought over like a, a Coke with a lime in it, and she said, what the hell is this? And then the waitress said, oh, sorry, we don't have any lemons. Uh, all we have are limes. We ran out of lemons yesterday. And she said, I don't want this. I told you I want a lemon. And she said, okay, I'll bring you another one. Then the waitress was talking to her for like a minute, and she was like, wait, what was that fruit you put in the Coke when you brought it out? And she was like, it's a lime. She was like, what does it taste like? And the waitress was like, oh, it kind of tastes like a lemon, but a little different. She's like, can you bring me one of those on a plate? I've never tried one before. And the waitress was like, okay. Then the server walked away and the old lady turned to me and she said, nobody here can get it and fucking anything right. And I was like, all right, ma'am, have a great day. We got to go. Although I will say she did midway in the conversation here. She also said, how do you feel about shots? And I said, shots, what do you mean? And she said, how do you feel about the shots? And I said, I don't know what you're talking about. And then she said, you know, the COVID shots. And I went, uh, you know, I think, uh, uh, <laughs> it was a complicated, uh, interaction. I, I was expecting like some small talk, but she got straight into the big talk, bro. K Kona. Well, the thing is like, she was wearing a mask when she came in. So I think if anything, she was trying to find out if I was boosted enough to share her presence. It was like an inversion of what you would expect the, the interaction to be, but Okay, Tomo, just, can you not, can you, can you, you don't, you, hey, you don't smack me. He's, he, he hit me like five times in my hand. <laughs> he did the cat thing where he went like, da, 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 da. What was that for? Oh, now you're coming back. Okay, apologizing? Oh, okay. I don't know, he, he hit me with the, I don't know how cats do that, but he got me good. You know what I was thinking? Did anybody else in this... By the way, we're going to start playing Balotro any second now. I did the slash marker like two minutes ago. Uh, anyone here have uh, two food bowls for their pets, but they only eat out of one of them? Like for some reason, the, the right food bowl gets used to zero, and then the left food bowl is always full of stale food from like three weeks ago for some reason. So I was thinking, great tweet is uh, the Tommy Shelby, Killian Murphy trying to kill himself gift from Peaky Blinders. And it would say, cats when forced to eat out of the left food bowl. Ah! Anyway, um, we, we got some gold steak decks, man. I recorded a little bit yesterday while my uh, in-laws were here, which was very embarrassing for me, but the show must go on. Let's try some gold staking, man. Let's try some gold staking. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. What do you do with gold steak? Minus one hand size. Minus one hand size is pretty horrendous. Pretty bad. That's okay, though. We do have four, five, six, seven, eight. I did see the, the uh, next step of the David Mitchell meta, where when you crop out the pizza, it looks like he uh, is at a melee. He's playing a melee set. And I have to say... No lies detected, bro. It looks like he's playing a melee set. And what's funny is that as time goes on, melee players are starting to look like that too. Ten years ago, you'd be like, yeah, but he doesn't look like he'd fit in at uh, Best of BC Volume 17. As time goes on, they ain't making more melee players, bro. It's becoming too real. I am going to take plus one discard. I am going to take... Ice Cream Andrew. 
I am going to play. That's not a full house. Yes, it is. Yes, it is a full house. Yum, yum. Mmm, so good. I'm not trying to rag on the guy. Did you see the video of um, the actor who went on to play NPC Miles Morales on TikTok? Smashing a bunch of Domino's pizza boxes when he worked there because somebody gave him no tip? You've been following the saga? I can't even be mad at the guy. I mean, he was like 20 when it happened and it was in the pandemic, but he did go like, no tip! Gah! Librarian, bring that up. I don't even know if they're here. I will say, at first I was like, who wouldn't tip? But then yesterday we went out to eat at a, a restaurant. I was going to say I'm not going to name the cuisine, but then I'm like, when I tell you what we ordered, you're going to be like, I'm pretty sure I'm familiar with what cuisine it is. Hey, turn one for us. Thanks for the gifted subscriptions, by the way. First off, it was, it was, in my opinion, it was the worst of both worlds. There's restaurants where you sit down and order. There's restaurants where you go to the counter and order. This was a restaurant where you sit down uh, and don't order. Like instead of the server coming back at some point and being, what do you want? She brought the menus and then we didn't see her again for like 15 minutes. So I was there like, hey, hello. Hi, could we? No? Okay, anyway. Hang on. This is a good one. I mean, listen, beg for your life, Suburbanite. Beg for your chat life, okay? I said I went out to eat. You typed to learn how to cook. That's insane. You typed the monka S after that? Honestly, you had the appropriate emotional reaction to being called out, which makes me think you're of sound mind. But you didn't type anything. You didn't type contrition. You didn't type... It's time to go. You, you're too online, brother. You got to take a little... Just take 10 minutes in the in the walk-in. Cry it out. On ban request. Sure, maybe I... I, I doom scrolled all weekend. I was immediately doing arguments in bad faith. This is the real world here. It's as close as it gets. I'm doing this for you, okay? You think your friend is going to be like... I went out to a restaurant this week. Oh, a restaurant? Learn how to cook. What are you, 17 years old? Bon Appetit didn't exist when I was learning how to cook, okay? You had to learn how to do the mother sauces from America's Test Kitchen. Came in a fucking huge book. It was like 900 pages long. Anyway, I said, I'll take number 25, large pho with beef balls. My wife said, give me a number six. Rare beef pho. So give me a number one. It's a bon me that maybe my daughter, I was huffing copium. I was like, maybe she'll like the sandwich. No shot. Give me a house special roll. Give me a shrimp salad roll. The waitress no sold it. She did no, no uh, pad, no app, no iPad, no nothing. She just, everything we kept putting on her, she was just like, uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. As soon as she walked away, I was like, there's no shot. She remembered all the numbers we threw at her. Five minutes later, she came back. Hey, I'm just double checking your order. You guys got like um, beef tripe soup and a, a small papaya salad, right? And I was like, no, nope, both of those are incorrect. I'm sorry to say. Anyway, the food came out, but lo and behold, there was a table uh, for six. And when they brought all the soups out, the people at the table for six were like, this isn't what I ordered. This isn't what I ordered. And they were like, hey, let's go check that for you. And then the table next to us, they were like, excuse me, can you come over here? We, there's a big hair in our piece of chicken. And then the waitress was like, oh, that's not a hair. We use a special kind of lemongrass that kind of looks like that. And they were like, uh, we're pretty sure it's hair. And then they were like, well, let me go check with the chef. And then when they came back, they were like, we're gonna, we think it's lemongrass, but we're just gonna not charge you for the soup. I, I, I have nothing but respect for the, the servers, okay? It's a hard job. It tends to be a thankless job. But if you're not using at least a pen and a pad, you're just asking for trouble. It's like a pilot that is like, we don't need to do the pre-flight checklist. I'm a good pilot. Like, if something happens, I'll just land. No, I want you to do the pre-flight checklist to make sure that, like, nothing goes wrong, man. It's just, they just write it down. It's just numbers. Anyway, sorry, we... Low momentum here early. What are we on? Anti-1?
No diamonds. Two spades, please. Two spades. None spades. That's fine. Thank God we got plus one discard. If you see hair, are you done? Or do you continue eating? We, we talked about it a few times before. You got to give it a try. Honestly. Not, not the hair. That's up to you. Hair in the food doesn't really bother me. As long as it's just like one hair. Um... But the thing is, like, I, if I have hair in my food, I just eat it. I wouldn't even tell my wife that there's hair in my food because she would be like, oh, that's gross. And it would put her off eating her meal. So I would just tank the, the hair damage rather than ruin the meal for both of us. Not even pick it out? Well, if I pick it out, she's going to be like, what's that? And I'm going to be like, oh, I don't like lemongrass? Like, we're at a Vietnamese restaurant. What do you think they're cooking with back there? Doesn't make any sense, man. I'm going to try something. No, no, no. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to discard. We have discards. That's what they're here for. This should be a shitty hand. That's okay. It's not even that bad. It's actually pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. But that's just the least I could do, honestly. Gains, we, I mean, are we just gonna do this? Are we gonna ride the bus and ride Square Joker the whole way? Like. I don't know, it seems, it's, it's not really my tempo, but we'll give it a chance. Fuck it, we bust. Okay, you gotta be careful with your phrasing on that one. But you're not wrong. 10-2 at least, 10-2. What's your favorite movie? I'd have to say Hardcore Henry. It's a little bit cerebral for modern audiences, but for those of us who like movies that are a little old school, I think it goes pretty hard. Crank is better. Oh, good. Let me guess. Okay, Boomer, you're a crankhead. All right. If you say so. I like... <sighs> this one's tough. Because Space Joker, it like seduces you. But like it doesn't work. It's not real. But then Gross Michelle is, is fake as well because it breaks. But imagine if it didn't break. Or it broke and it gave us Cavendish. I think Space Joker's a lie. I think you're right. I think I, I almost got seduced. If it breaks. Don't use death yet. I think you you wanna you wanna go far in this workaday world? I think we'll create a steel card that maybe we could death into later, but I'd rather death into something that immediately helps us. Squam squam me, squam, squam squam me, squam sorry, squam squam me, squam me. It's pure ass, bro. What do we care? What do we what do we care if it's pure ass? Discarding one card? What are you what are you doing? What are you thinking? What you're saying doesn't make any sense. 10 10 queen 9 8. We'll we'll see how we feel about the chariot and the death card. Wow! I forgot we had plus 15 mult. <laughs> Oh, four cards, you're so right. You're so real for that. Banana's kind of fucking up ride the bus, huh? It's all right, it'll break at some point anyway. Well, in that case, we should play straight dookie. Like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's right. We have to play, I guess we could play ace, king, queen, six. It's too good, man. It's too good. Economy. <clears throat> Taking the voucher, lull. You have to put yourself in my shoes a little bit. It's been like 13 years of motherfuckers talking to me like that. Like, I'm like the same age my dad was when I was in like the ninth grade. I remember the conversations he was having with people like, what do you do for work? Hey, did you see the game this weekend? Meanwhile, I'm sitting here, people are like, 
thing that just happened reaction, like with no explanation whatsoever, it's crazy. Motherfuckers think they're David Lynch out here showing, not telling. You're using words. Use your words, bro. How did it make you feel? Why did it make you feel that way? You should know by now why you mad. Origin, you, you know how capitalism works by now. Why you mad? I find your, your reasoning specious in light of the discourse that you bring here sometimes. I didn't say that. I know, I just said it. Now I'm asking you to respond. Even the mods aren't safe. What the heck was that? My game froze? My game keeps freezing? He's rejecting the premise of the question. Which is your want to do? 7,200 points? See if I care. That's like zero points to me. It was 2,900 times 4. I'm going to go ahead and say that that probably beats... 7,000. 25 chips. 25 chips. 25 chups. When you spend uh, $32 for a burger and fries at a Canucks game, what the fuck? 25 chups? We have lots of Australian and New Zealand type individuals living here. I honestly, it, it's a tough thing to say because pants goes really well with Square Joker. I think it's just like, it scales too slow for Anti-4 to show up as Eternal. Like, this is a, a white stake type gameplay. Gaining two mult every time we play two pair is like ass compared to one mult every time we play a hand that's anything. Pants go great with a shirt, bro. 16 year olds tweeting for the first time. Although, did you see the, uh, the, the, uh, I'm trying to think to help the librarian out here later, the best way to describe it. It was like, it's crushing my soul to know I'll never be as funny as my eighth grade cousin in the group chat. And then like the, the messages out of nowhere from the eighth grade cousin are like, uh, Hunter Biden when dear Biden shows up at the function and stuff like that. Hang on, I, I've got to search for this, because, like, without Librarian here, it's so good. Hunter Biden when Dear Biden... Hunter Biden when Dear Biden walks in. Why is it taking so long? Librarian makes it look so easy. This post was deleted by the post author?! No! All I can find are the replies. Oh, brother. Because the other ones were really good, man. The other ones were really good, too. Oh, well. It's all for naught now. <laughs> dunka, 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 dunka. This banana's been crazy, right? It's still alive, like fucking GLaDOS or whatever. Uh, I'm gonna say sorry to the Chups Joker here, but I got, you know, I got a straight in hand. I gotta play it, act like you've been there before. You're still giving me 10 Chups, huh? Different tweet from the same tweet author. All right, but it better be good. Taking the next step into adulthood today, picture is Costco Wholesale Gold Star member. Okay, I can respect, but that like, I just, I, I wanna see the, I, even if it's made up, I don't, I don't care if it's made up because it's funny. This is like, it's stand-up comedy. The one-liners that the, that were in the group chat were, were insanely good. Okay, well like you have to go because you're giving us five chips. These are useless. Honestly, I'm the kind of motherfucker that might just uh, respect my econ here, but I gotta take a look. Play only one hand type this round. Doesn't strike me that much. Doesn't, doesn't strike me as being that bad for business. I'm the kind of Andrew that ain't afraid to discard a bitch.
Just play it. No, you gotta play four cards. Okay, we need to play better hands than that. We clearly need a better class of criminal. scared there's never been a better time to do this and then just play whatever four cards you know pop up and play like w whatever three cards pop up help me help me if the banana breaks well we might not even need the banana to break now that I'm looking at it Please, 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 please. Oh, okay, that's fine. I got a little greedy. I got a little greedy. That's that purple steak coming to bite us. I know we're on gold, but you got, uh, you got that purple steak scaling, brother. Five, when six, seven, eight, nine, ten walks into the room. Hey, Anel, would you ever consider entering a cycling race? Why? You looking for uh, fodder? I know how it is. I feel like competing in athletics is like... A, and I'm not talking about like a fun run. I'm talking about like, you know, entering some kind of race or competition, like a triathlon. I feel like it's like a fighting game, right? You're like, man, I don't want to go to the fucking race because everybody is cracked. Because only cracked people are like, let me join the cycling race. So I see you out here doing your recruiting. You're like, hey, uh, fucking borderline cat five cyclist at best. You should really come to the fucking crit this weekend. Why? So you can beat me by 92 watts? You motherfucker, you. People suck at fighting games and join tournaments. No disrespect, but you have FGC in your name, which means you don't know what you're talking about. You're too in to see things normally. You might say, of course I know what's going on. I'm inside of the bubble. If you're inside of the bubble, you don't see the bubble. You just see the inside. It takes someone from outside of the bubble to appraise it for what it is. Doug. <clears throat> that's true, that's pretty true. Did you see the person who entered the Brooklyn Marathon by ignoring the signs and just running it anyway, then bragging about it on Twitter and LinkedIn? I didn't, but I do want to say, like, I don't care. What do I care if she ran the Brooklyn Marathon? What, like, without paying for it or qualifying? Like she just ran 26.2 miles with no bib? That's, I mean, that's like impressive. Bragging about it on LinkedIn is very embarrassing just because bragging about anything on LinkedIn is embarrassing, but the, the actual act of doing the running itself, I'm not gonna be, I'm not gonna be mad at her. Three, four, five, six, three and four when five, six, eight walk into the party. It was a half marathon. I love that we're like, hey, 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 don't give this stranger you just heard about too much credit. It was only 13.1 miles. This person you've never met or heard of before in your entire life and basically still haven't except secondhand. You're giving this lady a little bit too much credit. Cool. Six dollars to earn zero dollars, or four dollars to get zero cards. Let's see. Oh no! Wow! Oh, it's fucking ass. But that's pretty. Like it's. It'll keep us alive for a minute at least. It'll keep us alive for a minute. Plus, it looks fucking sick, bro. I mean, hit the road is okay, but it's just like it's slow. We got few discards, so it's uh, it's tough for us to do. It's tough for us to do. Squimmy, 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 squimmy. Well, I have to use it. I have to use it. We'll cut a two and a five. Then we'll pop the Emperor. Uh, judgment would go insane here. Lovers and World, two of the best cards in the game for people who don't know what they're talking about. And minus one, what do I got? Like like a hand size of zero, okay. Um. Well, I mean, while we're here, why the fuck not, bro? 
Why not? Thank you, popcorn. Very cool. I mean, you gotta, you gotta do something. The legendary Joker. Okay, hang on. This is a, this is a big moment for society. Imagine if I only wanted to farm outrage. Imagine if I used the judgment instead. Imagine, bro. I'm not gonna use death yet because we have to see what the legendary is. Tarbule, tabuli, bulgur wheat. Okay, this is huge. We just play. I, I can't afford to skip. We play as many kings and queens as possible. And let's make them into spades. Seems sensible to me. Kings and queens. Huh. <laughs> I thought the old lady threw it into the fucking ocean at the end. I went down and got it for you. Aw, oh, you shouldn't have. 19,000 points. Hermit. Incredible. Great timing. Um, I I think we skip on this one for a second. I think we're chilling. We can afford to get our econ going. How does this affect LeBron's legacy? Lakers are getting the reverse sweep, man. Honestly, I... Jokic. Who's the other guy? Jamal Murray. They're washed. They're washed. Free throw merchants. Two most overrated teams in the playoffs now, without a doubt. It's got to be the Nuggets and uh, definitely the Timberwolves, number two, I would say. They got no shot. I mean, especially when you consider that they're going up against LeBron. No chance. I would add you. This is like, it's bad from an opportunity cost standpoint because Hallucination can't do anything, but... We're rolling. But you know what? Any any molt in a storm, because popcorn's not gonna last forever. Me once I finish the trailers at the movies. Hmm. You should you should take one of these. And I I don't really wanna cut tens because they could become jacks later, which could become queens later. <laughs> Maybe that's a ridiculous statement though. Why is Librarian yelling at people on hockey Twitter? Honestly, like, I don't know. Um, I think that they're... They're trying to bait sports fans. But, like, it's... I don't mean to be rude, but it's not working. Like, you... Because I look at every single one of your tweets, the algorithm serves me your tweets, like, as you make them. And then I always see... It'll be like, you know... Nashville lost after a hard-fought game, and then you'll post something below it that's just criminally insane. It'll be like, all Nashville Predators fans are drunk drivers. Nashville Predators fans, when people with DUIs aren't allowed in the stadium, and then all the replies are just like people going, librarian, what are you doing? Like, no real fan is getting baited by the, by the insanity that you're putting out. Now, I told you this in the Discord last night, okay? That's only for round one. If the Canucks make it to round two and we play the Oilers, you need to chill out a little bit because, like, Vancouver and Edmonton sports fans, they get eight Molson Canadians deep. They would argue with you for, like, six hours. Really? Zach Hyman is a garbage goal merchant just because he stands in front of the net? Okay, well, why didn't he score 54 goals when he played for the Leafs then? Like, they'll, they'll go all day. They'll, they'll argue with you for weeks, man. Maybe that's what you want. I'm just saying be careful what you wish for. I'm going to sell it. I also feel like it's a it's a crazy play, but a hanging chad ballot I'm going to take. The reason I'm going to take Kings or Queens played first will give us an extra times 2. Spicy play, spicy play, but we take these. Come on, come on, how about some 910 Jack Queen King? Even made some money out of it. I don't believe it. How about a good Joker that can replace maybe Hallucination? 
As a number of times poker hand has been played to the malt, honestly, you're not invited. I'll, I'll spend six bucks on a standard pack to get a 50% chance of a tarot card. Hey, Phyrexian Alliterator. Thank you as well. Thank you. Holy crap, Lois. Might as well. Maybe some of that. Flat Molt doesn't do anything for you? What you talking about, Willis? Flat Molt um, then gets multiplied by two for every king and queen we play. Flat Molt comes after X Molt? What you talking about, Willis? I'm just going to keep saying that. You ever see different strokes? Only from its, if, if it's from cards or hand levels. Oh, I see what you're saying because the times... I thought you were saying you don't need to buy Mercury because you don't need flat malts. You're saying like your, your flat malt jokers are ass right now because the thing that gives you the most score is the X malt which comes earlier. I understand what you're talking about. So flat malt jokers are not as valuable as we may normally consider. I understand what you're saying. I understand. Some fucking chips would go crazy, though. Some fucking chups. Two molt for every five bucks you have? I mean, I... We don't need flat molt, but... The lad wasn't doing anything for us anyway. I'll give it a try. And I'll spend all of my money. Can I just get some chips, bro? Play only one hand. Okay. No problem. No problem. <laughs> well, well, well. It's crazy. I actually feel... Maybe it's not crazy at all. I feel like four of a kind is great, but wouldn't we rather just get one extra card that gives us extra chips and the extra duplicate? Sounds right to me. Nobody was questioning it at all. Everybody said that's the right play. Played face cards have a 1 in 2 chance to give $2 when scored. Get out of my face, you suck ass. Get into my face. Honestly, I want the tarot card. I know it's a huge... It's, it's expensive, but... I thought it was worth a shot. Either way, business card is going to help us out financially. We just need to live is not always a guarantee in this workaday world. Me at the McDonald's drive-thru in Britain, hang on, trying to fit into the culture but also expressing expressing my American touristiness. Can I just get some chips, bro? No disrespect, Val Sparco, you 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 fell apart halfway through because I don't think they have a McDonald's drive-thru in uh, in Britain. We do? You do? I, I would have assumed that that was like a North American only thing. Someone said, of course we do. What do you mean, of course we do? I thought Europe hated cars, bro. Make it make sense. I'll spend 11 bucks on this. I don't even care. You hate cars in North America too? Yeah, true. Horse-drawn carriages fit through the, the drive through window. They must not have that swinging bar that is, like, trying to stop uh, blue-collar Canadians and Americans from getting their coffee at 5.02 a.m. Like, if you drive a, a pickup truck, you're welcome at the McDonald's. If you drive, like, an 18-wheeler, I don't know. You got to go to the Flying J, bro. We have all that shit, bro. I'm just stunned that you have a drive through Are you the only country in, in Europe that has a drive through like, you can't tell me that, like, the Netherlands have uh, a drive through I don't believe that. They all do? I can see, like, Portugal has it. Spain has it. No disrespect, but how do you get into the drive through Because, like, every time I'm playing GeoGuessr, when I'm on, like, a, a European street, 
the street is one lane wide and there's cars parked on both sides of the one lane and like only a, a Vespa can even fit through the parked cars and only in one direction. They're like these 97 year old roads still carry people the old fashioned way. I don't think they have drive throughs man. I've never seen one. It's so American coded. In the suburbs? What, America or uh, Europe has suburbs, bro? I thought they had trains. <coughs> Pardon me. What, what do I do here? I think this is a tough play because I'll just level with you. Bootstraps and, and uh, hallucination don't do anything for our score. So I'm kind of tempted to skip and to choose two new Joker cards. If we don't skip, business card might give us enough money to make boot, but bootstraps, the flat mode doesn't matter, bro. It doesn't matter. I, as, as crazy as this is, I think we have to sell these two, skip this, and then we got to get some serious score. Hallucination, that's funny. Um, Green Joker is just too slow right now, though I love it. Hey, Ghost Pepper, Ghost Pepper, thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you. It's an insane play. We go Riff Raff, uh, Hallucination Cell, and then please give me something half decent. 12 Molt on a straight. Welcome to hell. Who gives a shit? That's pretty bad. We need big hands, which is why I, I discarded. I'm not playing a flush either. I, I want to see four of a kind or better. And I want it to be four of a kind Andrews. Okay, this this could be worth something. Please, 40 malts. Yes! Oh. <laughs> oh. Wahoo. Okay. Jumbo buffoon pack. Stop giving me this shit for a straight, bro. I literally don't care. I don't really care about Crazy Joker either, but Riff Raff just, like, doesn't really work for us. Uh, so we'll, we'll go misprint for a second. One extra hand may save our life. This is fucked, bro. Create up to two common Jokers. I can't afford to skip anymore. I need the money. Lebowski. $40, please? Oh, well, we got four dollars. Like that's actually we economically we fucking went crazy on that one. Even cards rank better. We we do not care. Ten dollar Arcana pack. It sucks because like I I feel like the the Arcana packs are very important for us because we need to get tarot cards in order to create more kings and queens, which is why this purple seal goes fucking nutty, bro. How about four of these motherfuckers right here? Yes! <laughs> 20 bucks in my pocket. Oh! First blade face card gives times two molt and a 1.5 molt after the molts get molted. That's, that's unbelievable. And honestly, I needed chips, bro. Smiley face, foil smiley face is like a perfect setup for us. That's in that's incredible. The game said you deserve this one. And I hope they're right. Is this first try? You always got to bring me down, huh? It's not first try. Okay, play only one hand type. I'm definitely not going to play just a straight. So at least give me a pair. I appreciate that. Thank you for the pair. We will not play two pair. We will not play two pair. We'll play one pair. And if we have to play it five times, we'll play it five times. 07, 07, Monka S, you have to play two pair or you lose. Shut the fuck up. We're gaming, bro. You literally don't know what you're... It's math. It's math. A little embarrassing for you. Not for me. I've never been embarrassed before. 
Except when that lady at the restaurant asked me how many times I've been COVID jabbed and I didn't know what answer she was looking for. I didn't know if she was looking for zero or six. So I just said, uh, <laughs> three and a half? What's the half? I had a Pfizer. No disrespect. No repeat hand types, okay. I'll play the full house of my dreams with no other support. That's pretty good. I'll give you a little bit of this. We might as well play the aces. If we get kings and queens, we're love and life. Anything else is kind of ass, though. Please give me more death cards or fool cards that give us death cards. Or, I mean, I don't know. I guess a gold, a gold card could come in handy at some point. What about banana? Cavendish would be nice, but... I think we're okay with what we got. I also totally think we could skip for a negative. It's very good because this ante doesn't bother us too much. And we love all our jokers, which means adding one joker has like disproportionate relative value. Repeating, of course. Temper is kind of crazy with it for sure. I'll tell you what, I'll start with three of a kind. Wow, that was pretty good. That's fucked, obviously, but like, it is what it is. <laughs> There's not really much point to taking it because we'd be killing jokers that I actually like. And then adding flat molt that only gets multiplied by 1.5. So yeah, we're not gonna, we're not gonna take it. It can't destroy ballot? Yeah, but then it doesn't do anything. Keep it on the far right? Why would I spend $8 on something that doesn't do anything? It looks cool? You can't fucking argue with that. It looks cool as hell, man. Style points? Scaling purposes? It doesn't do anything. Don't lie to me. You could say it looks cool. I'll give you that one. That one's like, it's on the house, but... Ah, for anti-8 boss, sell one joker. Now you're kind of cooking. Now you got me thinking a little bit. Yeah! Eight bucks just to put ourselves in a position where it could actually help us out? Sure, why not? And then just, you know, you're not going to fuck with this guy, so what do we care? I love that someone said, brother, it buffs temperance. It's so true, dude. Like... All we need to do is get two temperances in the next one ante to break fucking even for how much we spent on it in the first place. Wrong direction? Why? Explain it to me. Have you seen my dog? Describe him to me! No? That's what I thought. You don't know what you're talking about. The human need to always be a part of the conversation versus the human compulsion to never learn anything new. I just want more kings and queens. Just take me to anti-8. I, I, I love slash hate that you fucking got me on that temperance. Fuck you. <laughs> you fucking... You so-and-so. You fucking so-and-so. One of two. You're not wrong. You're not wrong about it. No 20, I think we don't need the 20 mold, bro. Look at this. 2 million points on anti-7. You have to mod him if he gets, uh, if we get 2 temperance? No, if we get 2 temperance, it pays for itself. If we get 3, I have to mod him. That just seems fair to me. Because, like, breaking even, that means your backseating is neutral. I would even take it as a, a negative because it made me feel bad. But if we, if we undeniably get financial benefit, then yeah. I can't argue with that. 
Maybe, but we got some unbuffed kings and queens left still, I'm sure. What did I tell you, bro? What did I tell you? Why not? A ban if you don't get any more? Yeah! Now we're talking! Now we're talking. I don't really want to lower my, my hand size. I think we got a great thing going. I would certainly love to create more queens. We have way more queens than kings. We got 11 queens as of right now. Rare situation, I'll admit, where you don't uh, you don't take stuntman, but it, it happens from time to time. Interesting enough. Who key? Oh right, it's not not a big deal, but like could have been a little smarter about it. Twenty molt me. Uh, 20 molt me? Okay, now, you are a god if we get the boss blind that is... Holy cow, plus one discard, Lois. You're a god if we get the blind that is you have to sell one card in order to get your cards to no longer be debuffed. That would be... That would be insanity. What stake is this? I don't recognize it. It's just a normal stake. It's just normal. It's kind of easy mode. It's it's gold. Oh! You! The knife! The life of the wife was saved by the knife. Holy! Go ahead and say it. Lizan Al Gaib. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They are. They are Lizan Al Gaib, aren't they? Boys' spice levels are fucking locked in. Huge, huge, huge. Roll me? Like, Sock and Buskin would go kind of crazy. Stop giving me this, man! Nobody likes it! Fucking chups. 100 chups. This is basically giving... I mean, it's foil, so it's giving me lots of chups. I'm, I'm content with where we stand. 270 grand. Gives us the Magician. I mean, the Magician's been fucking cracked for us so far, bro. It's hard to argue with the Magician. Still pretty good. Uh, run this card remains. Huh. <laughs> I'm not gonna use uh, Magician yet. We might find something better to do with our Fool card, and we are on the final boss of Anti-8 anyway. A ghoul. Hmm. I mean, I get, you're giving 50 chips. X3 mult on the final hand when we only have to win one hand is probably pretty cracked. May not need it, but... Send it, brother. Worth a try. Bloodstone. Foil Bloodstone. Hmm. I mean, on a retrigger, that would go crazy. And it's foil, bro. And you're just econ. We gotta try it. Because we're, we're only using it for one ante anyway. It's 50 chips for 50 chips plus upside. Toss it out here. Roll me. I'm looking for a tarot card. Sure, I mean, all cards being face cards would be great for smiley face, but we just really want kings and queens anyway. No. No. Okay, let's, let's launch it, bro. Get out of my face. I like it. I like it. How about... Oh, it's going to give us Wheel of Fortune. I should have used it on the magician. We're still probably chilling though. Ram, you gotta get it to go two times. You, you don't, well, yeah, I guess it's fine. Let's send it. Let's send it out here. Thanks for your help. <laughs> I'm greatly appreciative.
Let's try again. There's no bloodstone on this one now that I think about it. Glad I saved that discard. Glad, very glad I saved that discard. Holy brother. Um, let me think about this. I mean, five of a kind. Four of a kind is literally just better. And probably wins instantaneously. I'd like you to trigger twice. Or no, 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 no. Now that I think about it, I'd like you to be at the end for Bloodstone Potential. Well, well, well. Ooh! Golden stake completed. We'll try Endless. I don't think we're going to get too far on Endless, but we'll try. Aced it. It's kind of nice. Everyone complains about how hard Golden Stake is. Really? You're talking about Golden Stake? The thing that we just beat on our second try? The thing that we just got another legendary Joker for? I mean, you're like, we're talking about practice. Not the game that I love, but practice. We got a fucking Yorick just chilling here. Hey, Rip Bazu, thanks for the gifted subscriptions. Thank you. Thank you. Now, do we live long enough to actually get Yorick to work? I, A, I don't know, and I'll do you one better. B, I've literally never uh, gotten Yorick to actually activate. Which is very, it's, it's a little depressing for me, I'll admit. Can I, I'm, I'm gonna throw you some straight dookie, because I'd love to turn two jacks into queens. No more jacks exist. There's one total in the deck. Okay, well, I'll do this then. Honestly, what, what, I'd like this more than the four of a kind just because we could get 20 bucks out of it. Or 40 bucks. Or zero bucks. There's the... You could also... Oh, well, well, well okay. Maybe the, we're getting a little greedy. That's more like it. Ever heard of a full house? Yeah, we played it on our... Uh, played it on our very first hand. You may have noticed. Maybe you didn't. 35 bucks? Uh, 35 bucks is pretty good. That's like one pack right now. Pretty tempting. Pretty standard, really. Here a font goes crazy. Six of a kind? NL refuses to play the beta. It's an ongoing bit. It's not a bit. I just... You, you're, you're phrasing it incorrectly from my perspective. I'm not refusing to play the beta. I just don't want to play the beta till it comes out. You're the ones who refuse to stop asking. Look at it from my perspective for a second. Any call from the plumber? No, no call from the plumber as of yet. This I promise you. You'll be the first to know. How about four of a kind real quick? What? No, no call. I, I even, I put my phone on do disturb and I've received no, no phone call. What the heck was that? Oh, that was <laughs> our garage door notifying me that it's closed. I love the future, dude. I love the future. I love this. I love the future. Come on, we got you surrounded. Would you like to share your garage door activity to Facebook? We go next. Two milli, huh? Two million points. Pretty, pretty good. It might win in one hand, but I don't really want... I got to discard to get Yorick popping. I'm sorry to do it, my friend. I'm sorry to do it. It had to be done, though. Final time I'll ask, can you please put the legendaries next to each other for aesthetic purposes? There you go. I can understand your, your motivation for that. I can't be mad at you. Brother, another polychrome would go insane. I think it's worth shooting the moon on this one. Whatever, we're due. It just means we're due.
all diamonds are debuffed. Do we care? Did I miss the part where that's my problem? Please, what do you need? 11 more discards? I'm not sure it's going to happen for us. <laughs> I hope it does, but it's a, it's a long trip, brother. 20 molts! That was 1.8 million points. This is not going to be 1.8 million points. We might we might be in trouble on the next blind. I think this one we're probably okay. Yorick's a scammer, bro. He's close. I mean, Polychrome is crazy. Am I am I insane to think that we actually need the trading card for the Polychrome more than we need the Smiley face? I think Smiley's gotta go, bro. Smiley is making the build. I mean, you're you're insane. You're insane on that one. Smiley is. It's all your score. No, it's. Not, I mean, I mean, the chips are helpful. Don't get me wrong. Where's your flat malt coming from? The the quality of our hands, then multiplied by two to the power of six, and then with an extra one point five on top of it. Oh, but Smiley, you're right, the flat molt is added in hand. Hmm. So it's giving us four molts that then is doubled, then four molt, then doubled again. Okay, I think you're, I hate to say it, I think you're right. You gotta sell Yorick to survive? I'm not gonna sell Yorick to survive. If they kill me, they kill me. That's how every uh, Balatro run ends anyway. We're not selling Yorick for, for any purpose. Because one day, this fucker's gonna work, bitch. <laughs> Four milli? It'd be nice to get an early times 20 on this. That's early! That's early! Okay, less debuffed Andrews, please, because we, we really need these cards to do a little bit more. Okay, I'll hit you with some Dookie. Six queens left, so I'm going to hold the debuffed queen. This this might be an 07. Doesn't really matter, the order. This is, this is not even that good of a hand. We need to draw non-debuffed lucky queens. That's, that's, is Dookie. Five non-debuffed lucky queens, please. It's... Okay, there's a part of me that thinks there's a way. 40 mults. And go to the moon. There's one! Okay, we got the 20! Oh, okay, close. But you know what, bro? Gold steak. Gold steak ain't nothing but a peanut. And one day Yorick's gonna pop. One day I'm not gonna get him at fucking anti-11. I guess we died on anti-10, but still. 